Today is a very important day, or should I say tonight is a very important night because my lovely boyfriend, James, is actually coming home today. I'm so excited. If you didn't know, he travels a lot for work because he's a professional tennis player. I feel like every time I say that, I sound annoying, but it's <laughs> what it is. He's now coming home for a week before he heads out again. The long distance part of our relationship is probably the sh Part. <laughs> James is coming home tonight. I'm absolutely so excited. But the thing is, his flight comes in at 10.30. I would pick him up from the airport, but I do not have a car. <laughs> do I go Uber to the airport, see him at the airport, and then take another Uber home? Or do I just sit here and wait until he comes home? So what I'm saying is James worth $30 for me to see him like five minutes earlier. Hey Siri, flip a coin. Looks like I'm going to the airport. <laughs> okay, actually, before we go to the airport, I think I want to make him some brownies. Brownies are like his favorite food ever, to be honest. The boy is probably going to be uncomfortable and hungry when he arrives, so let's make him some brownies. <laughs> this is the mix that we're going to be using today. These ones are really good. I think my dad even brought them from America. Also, if you don't know, I'm living in Australia right now. I don't know if I mentioned that. My accent does not match the area that I live in. I have confirmed that this mix is from America because everything is in Fahrenheit on the back. Hey Siri, what is 325 degrees Fahrenheit in Celsius? 162.78 degrees Celsius. 162 it is. The crazy thing is I don't really eat eggs often and I bought these eggs maybe like pff, four weeks ago or something. Best Buy day, October 13th. That's tomorrow, let's go. Okay, while I'm making brownies, I'm gonna talk about James and I's relationship just so you can get a background on it. So James and I have actually been dating for almost four years now. Our anniversary is on like February 2nd. Number two is my lucky number. So the fact that he picked February 2nd, which is 2-2. Two -two. And we originally met in California. So I was a soccer player there. He was a tennis player there, both for the same college that we played for. And we kind of met through friends. So I think we met like early January and then within a month we were dating, which is crazy. But when you know, you know. Oh, it smells so good. So then I think it was about like the beginning of 2023, I decided that I wanted to move back to Australia. I was actually born here, but then moved to America. But now I wanted to move back. We actually moved on our anniversary, so I felt kind of bad, so sorry, James. <laughs> but it's just the cheapest flight, so I'm sorry. I knew our relationship was really strong, so I knew that we could do long distance and it wouldn't really affect our relationship that much. He was gonna take tennis seriously, so he was gonna be traveling full-time anyway, so it kinda didn't matter where I was. So I was like, all right, Australia it is. This egg does not look good. Ew, 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 ew. This is a way to test if your eggs are good. Is it if they float, they're good, or if they sink, they're good? Hey Siri, if an egg sinks, is it bad? If the egg sinks, it is fresh. If it tilts upwards or even floats, it is old. Uh, James, you might not get your brownies. Sorry. Oh! That looks like a good egg to me. But yeah, so with James and his career, top 400 for doubles and top 800 for singles. So he's kind of moving up the ranks with tennis right now. And because of that, he's playing more and more and just for longer periods of time. Probably before, like last year, I think he would go for like two to three weeks and he'd be back for like a week, two weeks at a time. But now he's been gone for like, you know, two months at a time or three months at a time. And he's back just very sporadically. To combat that, sometimes I try and go fly and see him. So I actually have a vlog of me flying to Brisbane to see him, but the dates kind of got mixed up. So, I mean, you can see it in the vlog. Pretty much James travels all the time and it's really tough because obviously the long distance is tough, but I'm really happy because I have a good support system here. I also have really good support at work because I do a full 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. job. It's actually looking quite a good consistency now. It's just tough at the moment, but I'm sure it'll pay off at some point. 
Don't be confused with the James Watt that invented the steam engine. That's not him. So you just have to do James Watt tennis and he will come up. Let's put this brownie in the oven. It's a little big, but she'll do. Hey Siri, set a timer for 40 minutes. She's clean. Time to go to the airport. I don't know if anyone else is like this for their long distance relationships, but I actually get kind of like nervous before I see him. It's so weird. I was tracking his flight on Flight Radar 24. Real ones, no. But it arrives in 10 minutes, so I thought that would be a good time to leave now. See you at the airport! Ah! Hi, Uber for Ellie. Thanks. Thank you guys so much for watching this short little clip. Stay tuned for more because more videos will be coming. I'm trying to go for one a week.